everyone, I'm Dathomar again and I'm here with another interview. Today we have this person. Who are you and how long have you been part of the Praxium? My name is Darth Kerr Okami and I've been with the Praxium for about, I want to say four years. Four years, awesome. Now in that four years, how has the Praxium changed or affected your life? I'll tell you honestly, it actually gave me multiple different skills as a teacher because I never taught anybody before. Uh, just really fun just to practice the dual people and actually just have fun with it. Awesome. So it's a lot of fun from what I hear. Oh yeah. Good, good, good. <laughs> now what was your original reason for joining? Well, I'm a Star Wars nerd. Not a super one that knows all the lore, but mm -hmm. I love Star Wars. And to get the opportunity to actually learn how to use the seven lightsaber forms to actually duel and actually fight. Yeah. Got me really hyped. I was like, I'm in, sold. Done. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Now, what do you think about the events and performances? I really love them. I, I highly enjoy performing for the crowd, going to them, and just seeing all the love that we get, and like all the support they give us by donating to what, what's it called? WVU Medicine? No, no, not WVU not. Children's Hospital. WVU Children's Hospital. Yeah. Hospital. Yes, definitely get a lot of love for that, and just yeah. a whole bunch of donations. Well, thank you, fans, for everything. We appreciate you. Now, for your next question. How do you feel about that charity work that the Praxium does? I, I love it. I'm glad that we're able to give back just for doing something that we love to do. It's just, it feels nice. What would you tell newer members who are joining the Praxium? What would I tell newer members? Yes. Sign up quick. It's fun. If you like to swing a lightsaber, well, obviously, I like to. Yeah. As you see. <laughs> so much fun. Highly recommend to join. And just have a blast awesome now are you excited for the next 100 events oh yeah super anxious though Ooh, yeah 100th event man that's, that's three digits man <laughs> Oof. all right anxious. <laughs> thank you for your time sir thank you hi my name is Daffermar and I'm here with another interview of the great members of the Praxium here today I have who are you and how long have you been part of the Praxium I'm John Ryan Cal. I've been part of the Prax team for almost seven years, as old as the Prax team itself. Wow, that's really awesome. How has the Prax team changed or affected your life? Uh, it's helped me with leadership experience. Uh, became primary in 2018, so had to step up. I was grandmaster for a while, but since I've been part of the organization, I've been helping out, helping lead. So. Leadership, I would say, is probably the biggest area, awesome. and learning how to be more detail-oriented. So, some life skills. Some life skills, probably important, yes, yes. Now, what was your original reason for joining? I wanted to fight with a lightsaber. I mean, who doesn't? Okay. Uh, just, I wanted to learn how to staff. I saw Ray Park with as Darth Maul fighting with staff, <laughs> loved it. So, I was like, I want to learn staff, and that was my goal, and that's how my fighting style. Okay, awesome, awesome. Now, what do you think about the events and performances? Oh, I love it. That's what helps keep me here. Uh, the entertaining the audience has definitely been, I would say, encouraging. Uh, seeing the fans react, uh, kids react, the kids hating me, some kids loving me, uh, mostly hating, but I mean, seeing how they get involved is what keeps you grounded, keeps you hooked. Uh, you're definitely wanting to come back after that. Once you get the first few people cheering for you or booing you, you're hooked. So, it's definitely a good part of us, what we do. Now, my next question is, how do you feel about the charity work that Praxium does? I'm happy that we do it. It's a good way to give back to the community. Uh, every group should have that community element, since you're part of the community. You're, mm -hmm. If you're living part of the community, you should help out the community. So, this is a good way for us to use something as obscure as lightsaber fighting to raise some money for the children's hospital. So, it's a very Jedi mindset to have, and I yeah. like it. Mm -hmm. Now, for you, a special question just for you is uh, what would you tell new members joining the Praxium or anybody thinking about joining the Praxium? Uh, be ready to commit. Uh, committing to your training, committing to your character, committing to our mission statement with getting involved with the community, with trying to be the best person that you can be, being the best character you can be. I would say the more you commit to it, the more you're going to get 
out of the organization. Okay. So, I wasn't big into cosplay and everything when I first joined. I thought it was a little too nerdy for me. Here I am, armor. I got a kyber crystal here. I mean, I committed. I don't know yours. I feel like the more you commit to the organization, the more you're going to get out of it, the more people are going to recognize you, the more people are going to enjoy you, the better fighting style you're going to have. Big thing is just be ready to commit. Right. Now, are you excited for the next 100 events? Yeah. I was here for all 100 events. I've made every single event. I'm going to keep that trend going. Got to stay strong. Hopefully we can hit another 100 before seven years like we did, but awesome. took us a little while to... Yeah get off the ground but here we are right over 100 events now awesome all right general and gal thank you for your time thank have you. a great day <laughs> hi my name is dr mar and i'm here with here i am sith assassin i am a jedi guardian and this is our <laughs> official 100th event of the outer rim practicing lightsaber school I love that. Are you grabbing another sucker? I'm here, I can probably do. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, this is exciting. Oh good. Look at all this stuff. We have a nice big open area for activities. Look at all that Hi. space we have for activities. Hi, can Hi. we record you guys? Sure, why not? Okay, who are you? My name is Angela Groves. This is my mother-in-law, Paula. And what do you do? I'm Here? Tired. I'm selling tickets. <laughs> oh. Are you part of Jack FM? No, I'm actually part of uh, Dave Flavy and his... He's the one that organized all of this. Awesome, awesome, yes, awesome. Yes. Are you excited for today? I am beyond excited for today. This is a great event for our community, and I'm really looking to see that there's going to be a lot of people come. This is a very interesting convention. Have you heard yeah. about the lightsaber fighting yet? Yes, I did. Are I cannot excited? wait. 1130. I'm going to be there. Oh, awesome. <laughs> okay, now I do have one very important question for you. Yes, sir. Did you get enough sleep last night? No, I never get enough sleep. Exactly. <laughs> I'm a mother of two. There is no sleep in my life. As Did a, you get enough sleep? As a rugged space traveler, yes. you must understand that sleep is hard to come by as the Sith are always after us Jedi. Hey, believe it. Give I us believe some credit. Yeah. We yeah. let you have some time to sleep. Can I help you? Yeah. Yeah. No. Well, thank you for your time. I appreciate Thank you. It. You enjoy, enjoy the con. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you for coming. You're welcome. Thank See you for having us. All right. Who are you? We are Teddy Soys. I am Teddy, and this is my wife, Jen. And what all do you sell here? So, a little bit of everything. Uh, vintage, we got some newer stuff. We have Star Wars, of course. Hard to let, let it go because that's one of my collections. Mm -hmm. So, got some wrestlers, some old. Let me ask you this. How many events have you done like this? This is my first one. This is your first one? Yeah. Well, I want to be enough. This is our 100th one. <laughs> so. As someone who's done this at least 99 more times than you, it gets better every time. I will say that. <laughs> it is awesome. It is a lot of fun to meet people. You have an amazing booth. You have Thank you. Things. Thank you. You gotta I, have fun. I, I am a little afraid of Vader. He is a mini Vader, so I don't think he's that <laughs> threatening, but still. Hey, size matters not. So it's, so, so it's balanced as all things should be. Wait, that's the wrong franchise. Hold on. He was, he was fighting against our cat the other day. <laughs> oh. Well, the, thank the you. The cat was curious. Did the cat win or did Yoda win? Yeah, uh, Of course, the Grandmaster never loses. Exactly. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. But thank you for your time. Thank I hope you, you guys so have much. a wonderful con. Thank, thank you. you. So, tell Whatever. us about your booth. Um, so, I am Repack and Collectibles. I'm Amy Repack. Huh? Funny, you know, pun for the last name. Huh. So, we've got um, any kind of pop culture, Star Wars, uh, all kinds of video games, Disney villains, which are like obviously my favorite. Uh, some horror stuff, Christmas stuff, Pokemon magic. I mean, like anything you could want. We have lots of stuff. Clothes, purses. Have you done cons before? Um, only as a customer. Only so as a customer? Yep, I'm a first time vendor. Sweet, awesome. We have talked to one of those already. Um, are you excited for today, at least? Yes. Even though I'm very sweaty. <laughs> yeah. Well, it is quite warm, you know. I, I feel, have not felt heat like this since I was walking on the sands of Tatooine. <laughs> but that is a dry heat. I don't know what kind of heat you guys call this on this This planet. is more of a Dagobah swamp heat. 
so. You see, Thank You Ball is outside of my star system. I haven't made it there yet. I, I understand. <laughs> not, not a whole lot to vacation there. Lots of mosquitoes. So do you like Star Wars at least? Love it. I absolutely love it. Like each one of these pops has been collected with love. So yeah. I am very sad to see the first story. Do you like lightsaber fights? Yes. Have you heard of the Outer Imperium okay. lightsaber school? Um, just from the Needed. website page. Okay, this is our 100th event officially. Nice. And we will be doing a performance over there. We're a fan of fighting sabers, people on choreograph, swinging swords around that we train for like four hours a week to do. Nice. You are one of welcome to come and watch us at about 11. Of course. Yeah, I need to be hard if we have it. So, I, this is your first event though. Yeah. Big time. In the words of Vader, we would be honored if you would join us. Oh, so then I better come. <laughs> okay, Sith. Just show me up all the time. I see hey. you are over there. I'm on the dark side, too. I, 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 I feel like this interview's over. I'm going to leave now. Bye. <laughs> Hi, my name's Dathomar. Who are you? Hi, I'm Jared Lynn from 3D Prop Shop. Oh, I'm working right? down in West Virginia. Working down in West Virginia. Yeah. That's awesome. We are located in Fairmont, West Virginia. So awesome. Yeah. We're going to be close. Right down the road. Yeah. Are you a Star Wars fan? I am. Really? Yeah. I got into it more recently in like the last five years or so. But okay, my, wife, the my wife really got me into it. Yeah. Now, do you 3D print all these props yes. or do you make these? or do you, you forged this obviously out of the best vibranium you Absolutely. could find, right? Yep. I searched and then the this, for it. I don't know where you found the best car to make that one either, <laughs> but that is amazing too. No, I do 3D print everything here. Uh, I got about 10 3D printers running around the clock with my website and my Etsy store uh, and just making stuff for myself <laughs> for the collection. Awesome. Awesome. Um, but yeah, mostly all the files are from Nico Industries. I'm a licensed reseller for him, so he makes a lot of the files and then I print, sand, paint, and finish all of them. Awesome. Yeah. About how long does one of these take on average? Uh, something like one of these helmets will take around 80 hours of straight printing. And then like if I were to like sand it, finish it, and paint it, um, I'll probably have another 20 hours per helmet roughly in the finishing process. Guns like this? Uh, so like these ones are actually resin printed. So these come out exactly like this. This is a raw print. I literally just take off a couple of the support materials you'll see, but this, you could pretty much go straight to paint. Oh, sweet. Same with these little scarabs. Like these are all resin printed, so like they're Perfect right off the printer, and then I just paint them. That's, yeah, that's really you get really, neat. really, really high detail stuff with these. That's really neat. So, are you since you're interested in Star Wars, mm -hmm. how interested are you in lightsabers specifically? Uh, I like lightsabers. Yeah, I've got are you uh, interested a Princess in... Leia lightsaber. Yeah. Oh, sweet! We'll have to get a recording of that. Are mm -hmm. you interested in watching people beat each other with oversized lightsabers? Sure. <laughs> so, we're going to be dueling here on this end of the um, convention. Okay. Um, at 11:30. Awesome. Doing uh, unchoreographed dueling. Okay. So awesome. feel free to come by and check us out. If I can get away from the booth, I'll come over. <laughs> yes. Excellent. Thank you yeah. for your time. I thank like you guys. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Have a good car.